that is quite negative. But at least there is good scope to turn a seemingly deep-lying defence into a more dangerous attacking outfit. This system will allow plenty of attacking numbers. Appear, Jim Beglin, to be going with a 5-3-2 formation. Well, if flexibility doesn't have an influence on this system, we truly are looking at an approach that is quite negative. But at least there is good scope to turn a seemingly deep-lying defence into a more dangerous attacking outfit. This system will allow plenty of attacking numbers. Appear, Jim Beglin, to be going with a 5-3-2 formation. Well, if flexibility doesn't have an influence on this system, we truly are looking at an approach that is quite negative. But at least there is good scope to turn a seemingly deep-lying defence into a more dangerous attacking outfit. This system will allow plenty of attacking numbers. Appear, Jim Beglin, to be going with a 5-3-2 formation. Well, if flexibility doesn't have an influence on this system, we truly are looking at an approach that is quite negative. But at least there is good scope to turn a seemingly deep-lying defence into a more dangerous attacking outfit. This system will allow plenty of attacking numbers. Appear, Jim Beglin, to be going with a 5-3-2 formation. Well, if flexibility doesn't have an influence on this system, we truly are looking at an approach that is quite negative. But at least there is good scope to turn a seemingly deep-lying defence into a more dangerous attacking outfit. This system will allow plenty of attacking numbers. There's the whistle, and here we go. Jim, which player is best equipped for this game? Yeah, Robert Lewandowski. He's just about the perfect all-round striker. Not least because he can finish equally well with... That's surely a foul free kick. A real chance if he can get through. 